Hey Android fanatics, Tech Frank Nan here from AndroidRoots.com. We're working on the Samsung Galaxy S3 and today I'm be showing you a ROM that's been ported from the AT&T Note 2 for your Samsung Galaxy S3 for T-Mobile, AT&T, Bell, and Sprint. So do keep that in mind. Um, it only does support those, so it does not support the Verizon or um, other variants as well, or, nor International. Just keep that in mind. So let's head down to Settings, and this ROM is actually called Serenity. So Settings. And let's go about device and it is obviously running on 4.1.1 obviously because uh, the Note 2 did come with Jelly Bean. So as you can see 4.1 and you got Serenity 1.2 right there. So it's really awesome. There's a lot of features that you don't get usually on the Galaxy S3 but you do get on the Note 2. So uh, he did port the whole basically a lot of it uh, for Galaxy S3. Now I'm not going to be lying and telling you this is very quick, easy and simple. Um, it's swift and uh, quick like every other ROM I've been telling you about. Um, there is uh, some lag usually when typing, but after you start typing for uh, like half a second, then the lag does go away for the rest of your typing. So let's try it out and see if it actually uh, does uh, show up this time. So let's start typing. Oh, sorry about that. We'll get into the widgets in a little bit. So let's just start typing and hopefully you'll be able to see it, but um, it's not a big deal to be honest. So let's start typing. As you can see, there's a little bit of lag. So as you can see, give it a few seconds. So you, you saw that there was a lag. And now it's working fine as you can see. Now it's uh, not lagging at all. So there's a little bit of lag, not a big deal. I just want to let you know so you don't, you guys don't complain about it and you guys are aware of it that there's a little keyboard lag. Everything aside from that is very fluid and clean just like any other um, Galaxy S3 RAM. So let's look at the widgets first of all and as you can see it's nice and white. So if I turn on data and Bluetooth as you can see it turns to white. I really like the effect. Not many other RAMs have a nice white widget, so it's a big nice difference and it just looks very nice with the nice black background. So you get nice white widgets, you got the obviously you got the brightness, auto, and you got the 15 widget toggle, which is really nice. So I really like that. Let's head on to settings and see if there's any um customizations there. So as you can see you still have the S pens and all the other things you usually get in the uh, note 2, but obviously you don't have an S pen for your Galaxy S3. So all these options don't really apply to you, but it's just, I guess, it's just here to have because it's ported from the Note 2. So you're gonna, you're obviously gonna have it if it's ported from the Note 2. So you got like dominant right hand, the pen attachment sound, and all that. So you really do know that it's uh, ported from the Note, and it's the AT&T Galaxy Note 2. If you are wondering, so let's look at gallery, and I do know that there has gallery uh, application from the Note 2. So here's gallery. And I would uh, recommend you if you want to get a taste of Note 2 on your Galaxy S3 while spending 600 off contract for getting the Note 2 or if it's not even available for your carrier yet. Uh, this is a good feel and you can get a little taste of it for uh, on your Galaxy S3. So as you can see you have this option which I believe only does come on the Note 2 and does not come on um, the Galaxy S3. I do believe, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure I'm right on this. So you got a nice uh, effect. It's really nice actually. And there we go, I reached the end. And it's, it has a super nice effect. Um, I really like it as well. It's a great way to scroll and look at, through pictures without it being boring. Also, as you can see here, this is 5 by 7 widgets. So the icons are much smaller. And you can see a lot more per screen, which I do really appreciate. Because I hate scrolling through, you know, 5 pages. Now, instead of scrolling through 5 pages, I have to scroll through 3 pages, which is a lot better for me. Because I can be much more efficient than scrolling through each page. I just have to look at one page and I got majority of my applications all right there. So I really do like that um, option as well From that was ported from the Note 2. Um, that's basically about it. Um, like I said, um, it's just ported from the Note 2. There's nothing very special about it. Except for the white um, 50, 15 widget toggles I believe. These are uh, different 15 widget toggles. Because you have the data and other things that are not usually there for the... Um, from Samsung and it is in white. That's the only difference I believe. Everything else is basically uh, stock from the AT&T Note 2 for the Galaxy S3. Um, very fluid um, except for the keyboard. I have not seen any other problems. No force closing, nothing like that. Um, works very well and if you want to get a good taste about how the Note 2 feels with actually spending the money or it's not available on your care like I said earlier, this is a great way to try it out and just see um, how the Note 2 performs on Galaxy S3 and it's just a nice fun way you know to experience a different d device um, software on a Galaxy S3 just is a great experience overall.
Um, and that's about it, guys. Um, that's about it. Uh, nothing else. No customization. No extra customization. Um, no like um changing LED and all that. Like I said, it's pretty much stock AT&T Note 2. Um, and that's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button right there. Give me a big old thumbs up below as well. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next video. And please don't forget to subscribe and give me a big old thumbs up on this video if you did find it helpful. And all download links for this ROM will be in the description below. Just click on that link. It will bring you to all the download links and um, this video as well. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next video. Enjoy a Note 2 on your Galaxy S3. It's pretty awesome.